Hey everyone, today we're gonna talk about Litecoin. So, what is it? Litecoin is an alternative cryptocurrency created in October 2018 by Charles Charlie Lee. Litecoin was adapted from Bitcoin's open source code but with several modifications. Like Bitcoin, Litecoin is based on an open source global uh, payment network that is not controlled by a central authority. Litecoin offers from Bitcoin in aspects like faster block generation rate and use of script as a proof of work chain. Uh, understanding Litecoin Charlie Lee is a graduate of the Ma Massachusetts Institute of Technology and a former Google engineer who became interested in Litecoin in 2011. According to Lee, in October of 2011, I was playing around with the Bitcoin Codebase, and I guess uh, the shot the of it was that I was just trying to create a fork of Bitcoin. It was mainly a fun side project. Script proof of work algorithm. Script is a password based k derivation function. According to Tarnship, the script k der derivation function was originally developed for use in the Snap online backup system and is designed to be far more secure against hardware brute force attack attacks as an alternative function such as P PBK diff E2 or BC script. Script was developed by Lee spe specifically to make the large scale custom build hardware attacks on the currency more difficult. Bitcoin's SHA. Uh, 256 algorithm does not require a lot of random access memory as an impediment to parallel processing where a script does. At the beginning of 2010s, as mining operations developed specialized hardware like the application specific circuit to solve a, a, a SHA-256 uh, hashing, it appeared the Bitcoin was vulnerable to such an attack by making Litecoin's consensus algorithm memory intensive. Lee sought, uh, Lee sought to throw out the hardware arms race, though in practice that didn't. It happens as the, uh, as the rise of GPUs answered the need of a great RAM. How is Bitcoin different from Litecoin? Litecoin was launched with the aim of being the silver to Bitcoin's gold. Like Bitcoin, Litecoin is peer-to-peer -peer internet currency. It's fully decentralized, open-source, global payment network. Lee developed Litecoin with the aim to improve on Bitcoin's shortcomings. The broader differences between the two cryptocurrencies are listed, listed in the table below. So. Uh, creation. Bitcoin was created in 20, uh, to, to, uh, 2009 uh, and Litecoin in 2011. Creator of Bitcoin is Satoshi Nakamoto. A creator of Litecoin is Charlie Lee. Uh, coin limit of Bitcoin is 21 million. Coin limit of Litecoin is for, uh, 84 million, so uh, four times bigger. Block generation time is then 10 minutes in Bitcoin, in Litecoin it is 2.5 minutes. Algorithm a shade 256 in Bitcoin and in Litecoin it's script. Initial reward uh, in Bitcoin is 50 Bitcoins, in uh, Litecoin it's uh, also 50 Bitcoins. Okay, that's all. Uh, Litecoin is designed to produce f four times as many blocks as Bitcoin. One new block every two, two and a half minutes to Bitcoin ten, and it also allows for four four weeks the coin limit, making its main appeal over Bitcoin to do with speed and ease of ex execution. However, because Litecoin uses script and uh, as opposed to Bitcoin's uh, SHA uh, two hundred fifty six as a proof of work algorithm. Uh, the use of mining hardware such as ASIC, ASIC miners or a GPU mining rig requires significantly more processing power. Litecoin ranks in the top two largest cryptocurrencies in terms of 
market capitalization and there is still remaining far below the bit of Bitcoin and as of September 2021 it had more than 66 million coins in circulation. Plans for Light Litecoin Litecoin has implemented several features since its launch intended, intended to improve its transaction speed without compromising the security and integrity of the network. SegBit, SegBit of, or Segregated Witness was first proposed for Bitcoin in 2015. It works by segregating the digital signal data, the witness, outside the base block in the blockchain, SegWit. It was developed to address Bitcoin's uh, scalability issue, but the proposal created deep controversy within the Bitcoin community. In 2017, Litecoin adopted SegWit, and because of Litecoin's similar similarity to Bitcoin, it worked as a testing ground or testnet for SegWit's reliability on the larger Bitcoin network. The test was a success, and Bitcoin adopted SegWit thereafter. Some opponents of the SegWit adoption, who advocated for larger Bitcoin block sizes, created a Bitcoin hard fork that resulted in Bitcoin Cash. Lightning Network The Lightning Network is a second layer technology for Bitcoin that uses micropayment channels to scale its blockchain's capability to conduct transactions. Similar to the SegBit example, the implementation of the Lightning Network on Litecoin has been a testnet to prove uh, innovations are possible on Bitcoin. Charlie Lee has also argued then that when the Bitcoin blockchain is congested and the fees are high, it's easy to use Litecoin to onboard into the Lightning Network. Mimblewimble Mimblewimble is a privacy protocol that builds on conf confidential transactions that encrypt or obscure information like transactions amounts. It's argued that Mimblewimble can decrease block size and increase scalability. Charlie Lee announced in early 2019 that Litecoin would pursue Mimblewimble development as, uh, as, uh, and as of 2021 development is underway. Complete, complete risk free with uh, one, uh, 100,000 in virtual cash. Put your trading skills to the test with your R free stock simulator. You can click it in the video below in the you understand. Complete with thousands of Wikipedia traders and trade your way to the top. Submit trades in a virtual environment before you start risking your own money. Practice trading strategies so that when you are ready to enter the real market, you had the practice you need. Try our stock simulator today in the link below. Okay, guys, it is all for now. Uh, in this video, we were talking about Litecoin, how is, uh, is it, what is it was based on, how it's, uh, what is the similar uh, it to Bitcoin. And that's all for today. Uh, see you in next videos, guys. Bye.